Friday, June 28th, 20, 24, Baseball's Comprehensive Look at Babe Ruth's Stats, a book I wrote covering 1914 through 1935 seasons. This video, 1925, a down year. Why? Babe Ruth only played 98 games. Why? Suspended, I think, by the American League president, Ben Johnson. Suspended by his coach, Miller Huggins. I don't know if it was sickness, drinking too much, partying too much, carousing too much. Something happened. He missed 56 games. And his production went down. Batted 290. Remember the two years before, he batted 393 and 378. This year he bats 290. Scores 61 runs, 67 RBIs, 25 homers. That's down from 46. And he had 41 before that. And then before that he had 59 and 54. So he only has 25 homers. Two triples, 12 doubles, 65 singles, slugs 543. That's down from the seven 800s he was slugging. 393 on base, walks 59, total bases 195. That's down from 400 he used to have. Stolen bases too. He had a hitting streak of 10 games, 30 multi-hit games, one two-homer game, 27 two-hit games, one three-hit game, two four-hit games, seven two-run scored game games, two three-run scored games, two, no, he had 10 two RBI games, five three RBI games, and two four RBI games. What happened 1925? Also, looks like he was in a foul mood. He was not the Babe Ruth that we, hit, that we watched from 1919 to 1924. Those years, very productive. Batting average, home runs, RBIs, runs scored. 1925, a bad year for the Babe. Just think, if he had had 152 games again, he would have had 50 homers. 40, 40 to 50 homers. That would have added to his all-time total of home runs, right? The 714. He would have been up to 740, 750. The ones for that 1925 season where he didn't play much. Also, the 1922 season, just 110 games. That's two seasons where he missed... Well, 1922, he missed 44 games. Then he misses... 56 games. So let's add that up. 44 plus 56. That's 100 games. In those two seasons, because of his not being disciplined, that's the word I would use, he was undisciplined. Kind of wild. So he misses 100 games. What does he do in those 100 games as far as his production numbers? Also, consider the fact, his first six years he's pitching. If he had just started as a regular everyday player, 100 games, 130, 140 games in those first five years, my goodness, his home run record would have been up to 900 home runs. Don't you think so? Because remember, in those years, he's, he's young, maybe prime. What do I mean by prime? Prime means that you're the best shape and you, you are just, you are there. You are ready to play ball and you're young, you're energetic, you have the skill. Maybe the first couple of years you start off slow, but then you figure it out. This Babe Ruth guy, he figured it out. As soon as he started playing every day, he figured it out. 59 home runs. He hit 59 home runs when he was 26 years old. 
that's pretty quick. Some guys don't start in the major leagues until they're 25, 26. By the time he was 26, no, by, by the time he was 25, he hit 54 homers. Then the next year he hits 59, back-to-back -back 50 home run seasons. And then he bats 393 and 378. He's a good hitter, too. Not just a slugger, but a hitter. I think the potent The way I look at it, if you look at 1914 through 1935, that's 22 years. His first six, one, two, three, four, five, actually his first five years, he's not playing very much. And then his last year, he only played 28 games. And then in 1925, played 98. And in 1922, he played 110. What's my point? My point is this. If the first five or six years, he's playing 100 to 150 games. That's a lot of stats right there. 1922, he misses 44 games. If he doesn't miss 44, add those stats, what the stats would have been. Then 1925, only 98 games. Let's say he plays 150 that year. Add those stats. And then his last year, he only played 28 games. I think his stats would have been an even more impress, impressive of what they are today. He could have wound up with 900 homers, 2,500 RBIs, and a 350 batting average and over 2,500 runs scored, and probably 2,500 RBIs. Instead, what do we have? We have 714 homers, 2,174 runs scored, and 2,062 RBIs, and a 342 career batting average. But he did all that in how many years? Rough. They say 22 years he did all that. But I'm saying he basically got most of his numbers in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I'd say about out of the 22 years, remember the first five are pitching. 16 to 16 and a half years all those stats. If he had a true 22-year span playing most of the time like like a Cal Ripken or a Lou Gehrig. Remember Lou Gehrig played 17 years and had that consecutive game streak. If Babe Ruth had the kind of endurance that Lou Gehrig and Cal Ripken had the numbers would have been off the charts and nobody would have broke his, his home run record. Aaron broke it, but it took him a lot more games to do it. All right, 1925, Dow year for the Bay. What does he do, 1926? Stay tuned, I'm out.